And this is a view from one of the HD cameras outside of the International Space Station. There you can see the Soyuz spacecraft as it begins to come well into view and is on its approach towards the station. It's under two kilometers away at this point. So again, what we're going to be looking out for is that 400 meter mark when they'll begin the fly around. It should be well in view by then. And I see the doggy note. So they're a great view head on of the Soyuz MS-05. The Earth passing by in the background at this point. They're out over the Atlantic Ocean. And we just got confirmation that the fly around has begun. So at this point, the vehicle is basically flying into its final approach attitude. So basically lining itself up with the Rossviet module to which it's going to be docking and is going to continue to slow down during the very final phases of this approach, but everything lined up, everything going very well with the vehicle. So you can definitely see uh, nighttime starting to come into view on the Earth below. And external cameras are working nominally. We'll copy. MS-05 just 67 meters away. Fifty is the range. Zero point two is range rate. External cameras are working nominally. And they get a brief view from the camera on the Soyuz, as you can see, just under 10 meters away. Almost there, standing by for capture. The crosshairs are aligned. Contact confirmed. And contact and capture confirmed. The station and the Soyuz flying 252 statute miles over Germany. Soyuz MS-05 vehicle docked to the International Space Station. We close. So with that, the docking probe will retract, bringing the Soyuz closer into Rosviet, and then they'll be able to begin the final stages of docking, which will be the latch series of latches engaging both on the Soyuz and on Rosviet to hard mate or really hold the Soyuz vehicle in place. But again, docking confirmed 4.54 p.m. Central Time, 5.54 p.m. Eastern Time, while the station was flying 252 statute miles over Germany.